we go forward now and say, right, okay, so on comes the weekend, on comes the immersion. And it's 16 hours and it's, there's a lot of content we go through it from the scientific rationale to the, you know, the applications and the techniques using the foam rollers um, with very different types of techniques, the self osteomyofascial, the more bony structures, the self myofascial engagement, the very muscular uh, uh, positions and tissues of the body. And of course, then we throw in some play and we throw in some self fascial mobilizers. So here we are on the Monday, you've had a chance to implement that pretty much straight after the immersion. What did you find? How did you cope with that 16 hours and what did you find after that? Well, it was, it was, yeah, it was definitely felt a lot more than 16 hours. So by the end of it, I was, I was quite surprised what we got through in, in that time. Cause it, at the start, it felt like a lot emotionally for me, it, it was quite heavy because I, I could feel in my body that I was ready for some change. And then from going through some of these fairly simple things, which I would never have considered until I'd done this, this immersion, is that my bones are where I'm, I'm needing a lot of assistance. And in this practice, as someone who's a, uh, you know, looking to help people feel better, I just never considered that. I, I'd heard about it, but I'd never thought to go there and now going through that process and experiencing it, noticing the change. So to put in, having the application, doing the metric changing and going, wow, having the physical change, the emotional change, the, the clarity, everything, just a very, um, a very enlightening experience, but also how simple it was. A lot of information, easily digestible, instantly applicable. Beautiful. So it's, you know, we, we get to that stage where, as you say, you know, we talk a lot about bones, we talk a lot about tissues, we talk a lot about fluid. And it was interesting, some of the comments you made this morning about some of your clients with, you know, how you would normally approach them when they come, came in or do come in. And now this morning when you did approach them and they applied the techniques, some of the outcomes. Mm. So yeah, in, in terms of, it, it, bringing something in straight away, you know, 24, with, within 24 hours of doing uh, the immersion, um, knowing that I have uh, my, a client who experiences discomfort, you know, ribs, all these things, and immediately what, I, what I'm hearing is bones. Mm. So thinking, well, if I just grab one or two um, techniques that I've learnt, can I apply these to the client? Can they notice, or are, are they willing to participate and then how do they do they notice an awareness and change or however your language is around it and then just seeing that immediate impact mm -hmm. and that's at the start of a session and then that dictated how the rest the rest of the session went which usually is something that's quite challenging because for this particular client they're very tired and that 10-15 minutes that we spent at the start doing some SOE and a couple of other things and some play it completely shifted and I, I was truly amazed. I knew it was gonna be good, but I just didn't really understand how immediate the impact was gonna be for that client. Beautiful. It's, it's interesting, isn't it, when we can bring clients in who are lacking vitality, potentially not being able to breathe well, mm. maybe not even getting enough sleep because of the fact that they're in some sort of discomfort and then to see them walk out with this uptake of energy, this smile on their face, you can see the colors change, you can see the attitudes change. So the, the, the ability to move people you know, multi-dimensionally, the ability to be able to affect all of the tissues, but more importantly, the ability to be able to change their mental, physical, emotional and spiritual aspect in a very short time is very doable. Absolutely, and, and you know, we can, we can help people or we can help ourselves to reset. And that's, that's one of the beautiful things that I've learned about it is that, you know, we can hit a reset button, so to speak, by, you know, just controlling our breath, connecting some, some applications. And, you know, we, we go through the, work, um, the immersion and we find those things personally for us, which is the, the movement or the application that you had the greatest awareness of, of an improvement in, in your body. And then you, you apply that and then you feel, well, this is what I need to do. This, and, and it takes one, one minute, two minutes, and it's an instant change. 
and the outcome of a training session is completely different. So guys, we'd love you to uh, get to Phil Soma, get to any opportunity you can, whether it's a workshop or an immersion. I always appreciate people like Lee because they're business people. They're people who strive to give their clients the best they can give them. And they're always striving to find the best solutions, the best applications. And in this day and age where there's lots of science and lots of research and lots of toys around, but there's not many results, Phil Soma is really striving now to be able to empower you to become a better person, better coach, better business person, so that you can live the quality of life that you deserve.